What's up, Granos and Granets? Juan Granos, back again, this time with another review. Um, right at the top of the show, this is a sponsor review. The items were sent to me by the manufacturer in order for me to review them for my show. So with that out of the way, let's get into the box. Um, so the company that sent me the item is called um, Wiz Tool. Uh, basically, is a company that um, does a multifunctional tool and it claims to have a bunch of functions so we're gonna check them out and see you know see what I think it's in, you know open the box so here's the box simple it's a nice little tin box um, and the box it says is uh, it's called a whiz tool and it's in the ultimate multifunctional pocket tool um, seems a little heavy but we'll, we'll see what's going on in there um, lightweight it has a compass it has a lead light it has a can opener it has scissors uh, ideal for camping um, it says military use and everyday use so um, let's check it out so right off the back here we have a, um, a little um, little card and it basically says that um, your order has qualified you for WIS2 um, VIP program. So go to this page within 24 hours and they'll give you a coupon for the next order. So that's that. And okay, so this is a little sort of flyer telling you of all the different um, uses for the tool. Um, one funny thing that I did notice on this flyer, if you look right up here, um, if you are a Lost fan, you will notice this dude right here. I'm not going to mention his name, but um, yeah, they could have used this tool in, um, in Lost, I, I, I would assume. So that's kind of funny. So um, it's basically, um, okay, a compass. Um, a, it has a LED light. Um, it has a bottle opener, a uh, cork screw, uh, cork screw opener, um, a can opener, a fish scaler, a magnifying glass, if in case you want to burn the little ants, <laughs> um, a large knife, a slotted screwdriver, um, a pair of pliers, of course, a Phillips screwdriver, a pair of scissors, an inch ruler, so I should say a three inch ruler, um, a small knife, a wood and metal file, a reamer puncher, um, I, I, I have to check that out, and a saw. So, um, okay, so let's, let's check out the tool, let's see what we have. So, here's the tool, and um, it's pretty cool. So, there it is, there is the, the, the compass, and I assume that pops up, yep, yeah, yeah, that pops up just like that. And, um, you know what, it's it's pretty accurate, I guess. North is that way. Um, so, let's get into the tool here. Um, so, the first thing I noticed right off the bat from the tool, it's a very sturdy tool. Um, it feels very solid. Um, you could probably almost use this as a weapon. I want to say that this weighs about um, maybe half a pound um, it is definitely hefty and it's in it you could tell it is metal is it is very built very solid um, I want to say that it is stainless steel I um, mean it looks tank stainless steel I mean I'm not hundred percent sure but it does look stainless steel and um, the grip is um, very grippy I mean I guess that's the word grippy I don't know if that's the word um, so here here is the little LED light and you know the picture says it's a little brighter than that but um I guess if you're in the in in, in the pitch black um, that would be pretty bright I mean I will have to test that I haven't I haven't really test that um, so let's get into all the tools here so let's let's pull out the, okay so the first tool here is um, the the mat I'm um, sorry the the compass and the compass just pops out just like this it just you know there it is um, so first tool that we're gonna take out I'm sorry I don't have any nails to take these out is the screwdriver so there it is so it's a fairly small screwdriver um, I want to say that this tool is probably something that you want to keep maybe in your glove compartment or your car um, and if you have a motorcycle you want to keep it in your you know your little bag of um, tools in your motorcycle um, because uh, 
that's probably what the only the only spot that you you would probably fit. I mean, you don't. I'm not sure you want to have this in your pocket all the time, unless again, unless you're camping or you're doing something that you know you're probably gonna need these tools and you want to just pull it out and and have it, you know, a tool set in your pocket. But so so you have this. So there is the can opener there. Um, the other side. Let's see what we got. On the other side and the the spring at you on this is pretty um pretty tough. I mean, again, I don't have any nails, so I'm using another another tool to take these out. And oh, this one's giving me a hard time. So let's well, okay, let's try to okay. Here's the magnifying glass. So this is the magnifying glass, and that's that's pretty cool. Um, let's see what we got here. Oh, yeah. This is definitely and maybe because it's so new. I mean, the, the spring action on these is very, very tough. So this is um this is the can opener, and I assume this is a flat screwdriver as well. Um, so there it is. And there's the can opener. Let's continue here. Oh, this is pretty cool. I like this one. So this is the pair of pliers, and it is um very um again very sturdy. It's, um, it has a nice little action there i mean i have all the other tools open so i can't really grip it but that's pretty cool okay let's go to the next tool uh, and the next tool okay the pair of scissors so the scissors so i mean basically this is um sort of like a leather man but it's a little bit of a leather man on steroids i mean it does have a lot more tools and it's probably uh maybe I want to say 60% cheaper than the leather man. I mean, a leather man is about a hundred bucks for you know top of the line or even the the simplest one. Okay, so this is the the large knife there, and I want to say that's about three and a half inches, maybe maybe four, uh, maybe three and a half inches. Let's see what we got here. Okay, so this is the smaller knife. Eesh. There it is, the smaller knife. Eesh. I'm getting all these. I'm trying to get all these out. Okay, so now I see the filer. So this is the metal filer here. There it is. Pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool. And, oh wow, this, this stuff is pretty sharp. I actually already nicked myself um, pulling these out. And, okay, so this is the fish scaler. No, no, this is not the fish scaler. This is the saw. And the saw is sharp as hell. So there's the saw right there. Um, so so far, uh, these tools are very. Um, I want to say that the quality that are made is actually pretty good. I mean, it, everything is really sharp. So um, let's see. Okay, so here's another one. Okay, so this is the fish scaler, and the fish scaler um, comes with the rule, the the ruler. I'm sorry, um, right on the on the piece right here so that's kind of cool um, so these are all the tools on this side of the of the knife or I should say the multi the multi tool I, I do should point out that here it has sort of like a plate with their name I'm with two on it but I'm sure that doubles as a reflective surface if you're stuck in the middle of the desert or whatever and you need something to reflect so somebody can see you I'm sure that works out pretty well so these are all the tools on this side. Um, so we got one, two, actually, so so I should say one, two, three, because the first two is a um, can opener as well as a, um, bottle opener. Um, so we got the knife here, the fish scaler, along with the ruler, uh, the small knife, the metal filer, the saw, the scissors, the pliers, the can opener as well as a flat screwdriver, and the magnifying glass. So, oh wait a minute, on the other side we have some other stuff. So we have the, um, the corkscrew opener here with a little, little tiny tool. I'm not sure how that works. But I'm assuming that this tool is another tool there. Um, I'm not 100% sure what it's for, but um, it came with it. So that, that's kind of cool. 
all right um okay so we have some other tools over here so i'm assuming this is the i don't know what this is well okay so um i think these are the spring back for the other tools on the other side okay this is that what they call the the reamer punch um so this tool right here um okay cool so what else we have one more over here and okay so these i think these two are just um sort of like the spring back for the other tools on the other side so i mean overall uh, the multi the multifunctional tool is definitely multifunctional um i'm not sure how much help this um no um, little compass is but uh, it seems to work here where I'm at um, yeah it's working um, I like I like the the feel of it I like the the material that is made of and it seems very like I said it seems very like a very sturdy tool that won't break if you drop it or if you know if you drop from you know your rock climbing and boom drops on the floor probably the the compass probably will break out or crack or whatever because that seems like it, that's the only plastic part of the item that I that I notice here. Everything else is um is feels like pure you know solid metal um, and and stainless steel. Um, but I think this tool for anybody who um, has a motorcycle that wants to keep a tool in a motorcycle. Um, at all times, this is this is the perfect tool in your car. You want to keep this in your car. Um, again, the the little LED light is a red LED light, so I'm not sure how much how much that will help in the dark. I mean, here um, it seems very very small, but I mean overall, the the tool itself um, it has a bunch of bunch of uses that you you know you definitely could use. Um, keep it in the garage or keep it at, I don't I don't I'm not sure if you actually keep it in your key ring. It it seems very heavy and it's very again very hefty. Um, but um it's interesting to review something that I'm not used to reviewing. So um, I want to thank uh, Wiz Tool for sending me the tool to you know to play around with, and I'll be playing around with. I want to see you know um, in my next camping trip. I'm definitely going to be using this. I do have another little tool, but it doesn't have as many functions as this. So it'll be interesting to see how this tool compares to the other one that I have, um, and you know see how it works out. So. Um, Thanks for watching. Um, you've been watching LG TV. I am Juan Granos. You um, you should look for us on, on Facebook, Los Granos, on Twitter, Los Granos, on Instagram, Los Granos, and anywhere else you can find the Granos. We're there. Okay. Thank you for watching. Juan Granos out. Peace.